Hello friends, welcome to my video. Today we will, so I will share with you the question answer of DAV class 6 science chapter, chapter 7, the world of living. Then friends, the whole, I hope the video will be helpful for you. So you please subscribe my channel and like the video. Then let's start. D. Answer the following questions in brief. Question 1. Name any three important characteristics of living beings. Answer. The three important characteristics of living beings are 1. Living things are made of cells. 2. Living things need food and water. 3. Living things grow. Question 2. State the differences between autotrophs and heterotrophs. Answer. Autotrophs are such type of plants which prepare their own food by the process of photosynthesis. Whereas heterotrophs are such type of plants which cannot prepare their own food. They use the food synthesized by other plants or animals. Question 3. Give two examples each of annual, biennial and perennial plants. Answer. Annual plants. Pea and maize. Biennial plants. Radish and carrot. Perennial, perennial plants. Mango and guava. Question 4. Give two examples of each, type, each of the animals which reproduce. One by laying eggs. Two by giving birth to young ones. Answer. One animal which reproduce by laying eggs are hens, ducks. Two animals which reproduce by giving birth to young ones are humans, cows. Question, question 5. Give two examples each of vertebrates and invertebrates. Answer. Vertebrates. Human beings and birds, invertebrates, cockroach and snail. And question 6. Write the names of any four useful products obtained from plants. Answer. The four useful products obtained from plants are fruits, vegetables, medicines and oxygen. E. Answer the following questions. Question 1. All living things respond to external stimuli. Stimuli. Justify this statement with examples. Answer. All living beings respect, respond to different stimuli. This can be illustrated by the following examples. Animals like earthworm move away from light and senile media. The tip of a suit stain tends to move towards light. The dropping of a leaf of leaf of a leaf or a touch me not plan a response to the touch stimulus. Question 2. A cloud is considered as a non-living event though it can move and can grow bigger. Explain why? Answer, a cloud is a non-living event though it can move and grow bigger because 1. It does not need food and water. 2. It does not respire. 3. Cloud is not made of cells. 4. It does not respond to different stimuli. 5. It does not reproduce. Six. It does not excretes. Question three. Write two points of differences between herbs and shrubs. Shrubs and trees. One herbs and shrubs. Herbs. These are very small plants. Shrubs. These are medium sized plants. Herbs. They have soft green stem. Shrubs. They have hard woody stem. Herbs. Veget example vegetable grasses. Shrubs. 
एग्जाम्पल रोज कॉटन इटीसी स्रब्स एंड ट्रीज स्रब्स स्रब्स एंड मीडियम साइज प्लांट यूजली हैविंग वन मीटर टू अबाउट थ्री मीटर्स ट्री ट्रीज आर टॉल एंड लार्ज साइज प्लांट्स स्रब्स दे हैव लेस हार्ड स्टेम्स दैन ट्रीज ट्रीज दे हैव हार्डर स्टेम्स दैन स्रब्स क्वेश्चन फोर राइट द डिफरेंसेज बिटवीन बेनिनियल एंड पेरेनियल पेरेनियल प्लांट्स एंसर द डिफरेंसेज आर बेनिनियल द लिव फॉर टू सीजन्स perennial perennial they live for many years perennial they produce one time perennial they produce many times example perennial fruits and vegetables perennial fruits and flowers question 5 name two types of terrestrial plants how do they differ on the basis of their habitat and water requirements answer two types of terrestrial plants are one mesophytes these plants grow on land need moderate amount of water supply for their survival examples mango tree apple tree etc two sericophytes these plants grow in deserts and need very small amount of their survival examples cacti babul etc question how are vertebrates different from invertebrates answer the differences are vertebrates they have a backbone in we they have a backbone which is made up of several small ring like bones called vertebrae in vertebrates they does not they do not have a backbone vertebrates these animals are well developed and have a bony skeleton in vertebrates these animals have a soft body vertebrates the examples are human beings fish frog birds in vertebrates the examples are earthworm cockroach snail octopus question 7 write any four uses of animals in our daily life answer the four uses of animals in our daily life are one animals like camel and horse are used for transportation of human and material two we get many different products like leather wool and silk from animals three animal excreta is used as manure and for producing gobar gas four many edible products like milk honey eggs and meat are obtained from animals then friends thanks for watching my video i hope it will would be helpful for you so please subscribe to my channel like to my video and share it to your all classmates